Today we'll discuss the Xbox One X setup that should get you up to speed with the basics to create an ideal experience right out the package. After you power on your console and go through the initial setup of selecting your language, network and location, then the update follows. After that, you sign into your Microsoft account and select your sign in and security preferences. Finally, after selecting time zone, your power options and update settings, come the steps we're going to talk about in this video. Without further ado, here is how you can set up Xbox One X to backup games via external drive or over network, calibrate TV settings and set it up for 4K. Begin with backing up games. This step is for those users who already have an Xbox One or Xbox One S. This can be done via an external drive or over the network. For external drive, grab yourself an external USB drive with USB 3.0 and 256GB or higher storage and save all your settings from your elder Xbox One. Later, connect an external HD to the Xbox One X, go to Settings, then System, then Storage, and you'll hopefully see your external drive appear. Click the drive and select Format for Games and Apps, then Format Storage Device, then enter a name. Next step is to copy each game individually. To do this, head to My Games and Apps, Games, and move to the game or app you'd like to copy. Press the menu button on the Xbox One X controller and a pop-up menu should appear where you should select Manage Game. Select Move, Copy, Move All or Copy All and move to the new drive accordingly. Use these steps again to transfer games from the external storage drive to your Xbox One X by selecting the proper storage device in your Games or Apps menu once your external storage is connected to your new console. You can also opt to just keep the games or apps on this external drive whenever the Xbox One X is in operation and play from there. During the initial basic setup, your Xbox One X will check for the available network connections and display them. Scroll to your wireless network name, enter the password and your console will be connected to the internet. Enabling network game transfer is important if you have a lot of games you want to move. You'll need to have your current Xbox and Xbox One X units plugged into power at one time and the ability to connect at least one console at a time to a display with HDMI. Beginning with the source Xbox, open settings, network, network transfer and check the box. Once this is checked, make certain this Xbox is connected to the same network as the Xbox One X. Move to the Xbox One X and go to settings, network, network transfer and your other Xbox should be listed. This will enable you to select games and copy them over network. Assuming you've already got an Xbox One or One S, you have the ability to download 4K versions of the games you have already purchased just as long as those games have 4K upgrades in the first place. Go to settings, system and choose backup and transfer then check download 4K content. You can later transfer these via USB or over your home network. If you want the 4K content to download on its own as it becomes available, then look for updates in system and check it. Once you've bought or already own a 4K television with HDR capabilities, then comes the time to set your TV up right. Failing to do so will make the picture quality suffer, particularly when dealing with HDR enhanced games. Go into display and sound in your Xbox settings and you will find the option to calibrate your TV under the video output menu. The Xbox One X comes with a proper HDMI cable in the box. This is the only HDMI cable you'll need unless you're running some other sort of video system through the Xbox One X. In which case, don't be confused by specifically branded 4K HDMI or 2.0 HDMI cables. Just ensure that yours is HDMI high speed branded. To make sure that all 4K settings are on and working, press the Xbox button on the controller to bring up the guide. Go to Systems, select Settings, Display and Sound, select Video Output, then select Advanced Video Settings. 
This menu lets you choose your TV's HDR bit and whether to allow your Xbox One X to run at 50Hz, 24Hz, whether to allow HDR, 4K, YCC422 or even 3D. You can even use the 4K TV details button to check what your TV or monitor is able to output. Now that you've got your Xbox One X set up to output 4K images and provided you've downloaded the 4K game content, anytime you boot up an Xbox One X enhanced game, it will automatically use the 4K textures and run at the best possible frame rate. If you ever shift your Xbox One X around or upgrade to a different TV, make sure you take the time to check the 4K settings. That's all for this setup guide. Subscribe for more Xbox One X guide tips and tricks and like this video for good measure. Until next time.